Tonight, we're delighted to have with us the British heavyweight and light heavyweight champion of the 30s, Jack Peterson, a son of Cardiff as well. Jack, I must say, at 76, nearly 77, you're looking fine. Can I just cast your mind back to that fight against Mean, what, 56 years ago when you won the title? 1932, very exciting time for me because I was 20 years old. I had won the light heavyweight championship by beating Harry Crossley in May. And then to fight and win the heavyweight championship was rather wonderful. The first notch on my wonderful, uh, wonderful Lonsdale belt. What about the homecoming back here to Cardiff? How tremendous. much do you remember of that? That was terrific. Had uh, more people than you had this year tonight watching this, I can assure you. It was in the open air and I had a civic reception in Cardiff um, Centre. And it really was something well worth remembering. Well, let me just tell you, we also have some pictures of you when you regained the title a couple of years later. Tell me a bit about that one. I lost to Harvey over 15 rounds in the Albert Hall. I think it was November the 30th, but I didn't think I'd lost the fight. I told Len off and afterwards, so I had a return match with him at the White City, the biggest crowd I think they'd ever had there, and uh, I won. In your role as a president now, as a boxing authority, tell me, what do you think about the state of the heavyweight division? I always felt that we had more competition when we were, when I was younger, in the 30s. We had some tremendous fighters. It's a bit up and down. You get some pretty good fighters. I know we've got a couple of world champions, the little Welshman, Dickie, the junior champion. And we have uh, Hunnigan regaining his title. We've got Frank Bruno, of course. Frank Bruno's coming along. He's big and he's strong. He's fought for the world championship. And I suppose he must be the best we have at the moment. But there's plenty would of he, Would he have lived with you, Bruno? Now, that is a silly question <laughs> to ask me, isn't it? <laughs> I always think when you go back, would Dempsey have beaten Lewis and all that sort of nonsense? But I always like to think when I got in the ring that I could beat anybody I got in the ring with. So obviously at that time, if I fought, if Bruno was around that time, of course I would have beaten him. Well now to the best or 